artist John T for the Boxing Voice. I'm talking to Milton Keynes' own Hamza Mahmood. How are you, Hamza? Uh, thank you very much. Yeah, I'm good, thank you. How are you? Yeah, I'm good, thanks, mate. Okay, so tell us a little bit about your amateur career. So, yeah, I mean, um, I started back in uh, 2010. Uh, I had my first uh, competitive fight uh, when I was 11 years old. Um, boxed for a local club there, uh, MK Victors, and uh, sort of just, I was there around about, for about six, seven years. And then 2017, I sort of moved to Hodgson, and that's when uh, everything sort of changed for really my amateur career. I, um, in my first season, um, I won, uh, traveled to two international countries, won two uh, gold medals. Uh, and then uh, my first season, uh, I uh, won the senior uh, heat ABS and uh, became 52 flyweight champion. And uh, so uh, went on again and uh, retained it and became two time national champion. Two time national champion, yeah. that's amazing. Yeah, yeah. Really good for the CV there. So, you're not going everyone in this gym pretty much has just turned over to be pro. There's one or two that are amateurs. You're definitely stand as an amateur. My understanding is you're focusing on the 2024 Olympics and maybe you getting in that GB squad? Yeah, so yeah, God willing. Uh, I thought the selection process goes well for uh, Team GB. I'm uh, sort of aiming for. Uh, the 2024 Olympics and uh, just see how it goes really I mean the 2022 Commonwealth Games is next year as well so you know if I do put uh, on uh, like if I do sort of progress uh, quick on uh, the GB team I might just put me on there as well so it sounds like you've got a good chat about you've been fighting since the age of 11 so if it yeah. starts well for you um, I mean I've been doing this for a long time now so I mean uh, I've got I've got the experience I've gained the sort of achievements you need as well and uh, not many people have been sort of two time uh, not even you know not even won a elite national champions uh, so just got winning, you know what I mean? Just go on to Team GB and go from there. How would that look? Because Team GB is in Sheffield, you live in Milton Keynes, and then you travel down south to train in Hoddesdon in Hertfordshire. Anyway, would you still train in the Bear Cage here t as well? Of course, or? of course. Uh, uh, I'll never forget uh, the Bear Cage. I mean, Sab, uh, Alex, all the coaches have done a lot for me. Uh, and they basically, you know, in shape me to box around today. So um, definitely, I'll definitely come here uh, uh, on the days I'm off. So, uh, so if you're on sort of podium potential, GB, uh, you're sort of there four days a week, even podium or podium potential. So you've still got three of the three days to sort of to yourself. So maybe I'll come down here and train with Sab uh, once a week as well, so just to gain gain more knowledge and sort of stay sharp. And, and that's fine, obviously, with Alex and Sab. What about the you know, GB? Did they expect that? They think that'd be right because yeah, you'd yeah. be under Rob McCracken up there, wouldn't you? Um, yeah, I mean, they they um, they sort of. I don't really think they pay too much attention to who you are, uh, really, or if you if you're still affiliated with your uh, local, I mean, your, your club. So or most of the other GB boxers, they sort of train with their old club anyway. So when they're off, uh, off the sort of the, the rest period, so, yeah. Well, we'll be watching you closely when you get back out fighting. Obviously, the COVID stopping that at the moment, and uh, hopefully, you'll be out on the Commonwealths next year. God willing, going with co Commonwealths and uh, the big one, the, the Olympics. Uh, that's the dream. So, yeah, just staying sharp, staying ready, and you know, uh, just praying for the best. Really. Good stuff. Thanks for chatting to us, Hamza. Thank you for your time. Thank Catch you soon. Cheers. If you enjoyed the video. Feel free to hit the like, subscribe, and share. As always, if you want to support us to the next level, head over to the Patreon dot com backslash the boxing voice we have tons of exclusive from border wars and title betting shows the list goes on and on and on but in addition to that if you guys have questions for fighters trainers and promoters this is where you can submit them we will run out get these questions answered and put it back on the show just for you guys appreciate it peace